and gentlemen, welcome to the Texas Rep Theater. My name is Jamie Salinas. We're going to have lots of fun this evening, but I do want to remind you that we are on the set of a fantastic play, Crimes of the Heart. If you have not seen it, I highly recommend you come out and see this play. It's fantastic. It's uh, mesmerizing. It's charming. It's witting. Uh, the actors are fantastic. So I do highly recommend you come out and see the, the program. Fantastic stuff. Really good stuff for you guys. All right. Now, before we go any further, I'd like to perform a classic in magic. In fact, this has a name. It's called the old rope trick. <laughs> Anyone know why it's called the old rope trick? It's an old rope, that's right. Now, I've had many requests this evening. Despite that, I'll perform this trick anyway. <laughs> now, ropes have various parts. I know the rodeo's in town, so ladies and gentlemen, please bear with me. I do drive a truck, I have a couple of horses, but I am not a real cowboy. I found out from a real cowboy that these two parts have a special name. Can anyone tell me what these two parts are called? The ends. Oh. Where are you guys from? Are you from Pasadena? Okay. All right. We have some true Texans here tonight. Between the ends, it's called the middle. middle. Fantastic. Now, some of you are having trouble. All right. So let me help you guys out. I don't want to point anyone out. So let me help you guys out. I'll take the ends, wrap them around each other. So the opposite of the two ends, that, of course, is the middle. Are you guys with me? Okay. Guys, here, let me help you out. These are the ends, these are the ends, and this is the middle, which is no big deal. I can tell by the applause. No, no, it's too late now. <laughs> Let's start all over then, okay? I'll take those ends, place them right back on the rope, give them a little squeeze, a little twist, a little blow, and that way I can start all over. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, some of you are not applauding. Yes, I can see you, and I know why. Because, see, pulling the ends off is very simple. Any magician can pull the ends off. Am I right, sir? Yeah, you see that on television. You see it all the time. However, it takes a great magician to take the middle out. You guys want to see me take the middle out? Yes. Yes. Okay, I will take the center, the middle, out of the piece of rope. So to do that, we have to isolate the ends. So I'll tie them off in a nice tight knot. So the opposite of the ends, that of course is the middle. The middle. That's right. Now, um, I need a pair of scissors. A pair of scissors. A pair of, oh, I got an idea. I'll use the magic pair. So I can reach out, cut the rope into two equal pieces where the ends appear where the middle is. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not the middle, is it? No, no, see, I missed it. I missed it. See, this one's much shorter. That one's much longer. Would you guys like to see me move the knot to the very center? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, watch. <sighs> Ta da! Okay. I can fold them in Pasadena. Not here tonight. Okay. See. Oh, yeah, they're not as smart. Yes, theater goers, you guys realize I just simply let it go. Yeah, you guys are way too smart that, for that. If I would have really moved it right about there, you guys would be applauding wildly, all right? Yes. Okay. Now, two snaps, a little blow. I take the very middle, pull it completely off. That's how I take the center out of a piece of rope. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, I know what some of you are thinking. Some of you are thinking, Jamie, I know those are trick ropes. I saw that gentleman with a mask on television. He showed us how it was done. Those ropes, they had magnets on the end, Velcro, snap fasteners, things like that. We saw that. So to prove this is not the same pieces of rope that you saw on that uh, television show, gentlemen up front, would you examine that piece of rope, pull on it, does not stretch, does not shrink, does not grow. Look on the ends, make sure there's no magnets, no Velcro, no snap fasteners, no WMDs, nothing like that. Pass it around so several people can see that, all right? And uh, the gentleman back there, yes, sir, examine that piece of rope, pull it and make sure it's a solid piece of rope. Solid as well, it does not stretch, does not shrink, does not grow. I have one more piece of rope. You, sir, what is your name? Scott. Scott, would you hold on to one end, please, Scott? All right, hold it tight. Scott, I want you to hold it up so everyone can see. Um, hold it tight, give it a big jerk. Perfect, I'll give mine a big jerk. 
Just want to prove it's a solid piece of rope with a big jerk at each end. <laughs> no, no, that's not what I meant, all right? <laughs> no, no, no. He's going to make a hangman's noose out of that. Huh? Scott, make sure it's a solid piece of rope for me, please, all right? Who has the small piece of rope? Who's got the small piece? Oh, will you toss it to me, please? Yes, on the count of three. <laughs> Were you the guy helping Claude? <laughs> oh, that was the lawyer. Okay, all right. All right, that's the small piece of rope. That's the small piece of rope. Who has the giant long piece of rope? Yes, sir. One, two, three. There we go. Thank you very much. Now, for those of you who did not bring your bifocals, this is the small rope. This is the long piece of rope. All right. My friend over here, Scott, you have the one that's just right. May I? Thank you very much. Let's give Scott a big hand for being a great sport. Thank you, sir. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you've seen me perform a little magic so far. I will now perform for you an illusion. An illusion with three pieces of rope. A small piece of rope, a medium piece of rope, and a very, very long piece of rope. That's the long piece. Next comes the medium piece. Last but not least, the small piece. Now, watch carefully as the ropes now stretch, shrink, and grow to form three equal pieces. Now that is an illusion. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now for those of you keeping track, this is rope number one. It does not stretch. It does not shrink. It does not grow. This is rope number two. It does not stretch. It doesn't shrink. It doesn't grow. That's rope number three. It does not stretch. It doesn't shrink. It doesn't grow. Now ladies and gentlemen, that is impossible. Well, you guys know it's impossible because it's an illusion. An illusion with a small piece of rope. It's an illusion with a medium piece of rope. And of course, a long piece completing the illusion with a three piece of rope. Thank you very much. Thank you.